welcome to Chris Kolaole YouTube channel. God bless you. This is the final episode of 7 Things Christian Mushroom Man. God bless you. Remember, Jesus. Jesus. Remember he is coming back again. He will return back. He is coming back again. He is coming back again. He went out and promised that he's coming back again. He's coming back again. Oh, he's coming back again. Oh, glory, hallelujah. He's coming back. Beloved, listen to me. If he is not coming back again, you and I will be hopeless. If he's not coming back again, he will have died for himself alone. If Adib is not coming back again, we will not have the final hope. If he's not coming back again, why are we now suffering and enduring persecution? It's because he's coming back again. He didn't leave us alone like that. He told the disciples, It is expedient that I go. Meaning, it will do you more better, more good that I go. Things will be better for you when I go. Things will be greater for you when I go. Why? Because I am coming back again. And the angel of the Lord appeared when he was going up and he was being carried away in the book of Acts of Apostles. He said, Lo, Jesus, whom you see taken away, shall appear in like manner. He will come back in like manner. He has gone, but he's coming back again. Remember, he's coming back again. You have forgotten that he's coming back again. You always play in his name. But you have forgotten he's coming back again. You are living your life as if he's not coming back again. You do anything you like as if he's not coming back again. You say you are born again, yes. Do you always remember that he's coming back again? In the book of First Thessalonians, chapter 4, I will read verse 16 and verse 17. He says, For the Lord himself shall descend from heaven with a shout and with the voice of archangel and with the trump of God and the dead in Christ shall rise first then we we which are alive and remain shall be caught up together with them in the cloud to meet with the Lord in the air and so we shall ever be with the Lord. He's coming back again. So that where he is, we'll be there. In the book of John, he said, do not let us be troubled. He said, I go, but I'm coming back. And I will take you to where I am. That you also may be with me. Are you ready for his coming back again? Are you prepared for the trumpet to sound? Are you ready for the rapture? The coming back again is the rapture. Is caught up ready for Thessalonians chapter 4. I got to Jesus. I get to Thea. I'm a holedo. I'm a holedo. I go Jesus. The rapture is near. We are in the end of age. If your eyes not open from 2021, begin to see the series of events. 
and look at what is happening the earth is speeding up is speeding up the world is speeding up for rapture and the coming of Jesus some people they said they said from abroad that the progress and the inventions the world witness in the last hundred years will be witnessed in the next four years the invention and the things that will happen will be equal to, in the four years will be equal to what has happened in hundred years they were even discouraging going to university is not necessary that you are wasting your time go and learn computer learn all this modern artificial intelligence where you will use and the rest what is happening here they are rushing to the end of the age the world is moving faster the way it was moving 100 years ago it's not the way it's moving now don't stop it because whether you pray or you don't pray whether we believe or you don't believe Jesus is coming back rapture must happen the world must end the world must collapse so better be remembering better get ready I Jesus I Jesus never tell us to forget. If you forget, you can miss the rapture. Rapture is what people should prepare for. Jesus is coming to redeem the believers. To redeem them that serve him. He's coming so that we meet him with him in the cloud. Many are sleeping. A lot have forgotten. Many are un 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 unconscious of Jesus' return. Many of us have lost faith in it. Our God is never a promise and faith. Any word he has spoken will forever come to pass. I am a testimony of that. I have heard God clearly. And when He says it, it's over. When He says it, it's over. I have heard God clearly. I really touch me. I know it is certain. And what will not make me to believe that Jesus will not return? There are people who are saying for more than 2,000 years, they say Jesus will soon come. And the sun has never come. The word of God never fails. The word of God stands sure. The word of God is forever set in heaven. You cannot stop the word of God. No power can stop the word of God. No man can stop the word of God. You will only work for it. Believe it as if you are not working for it. Look at Jesus Christ. God said, I'm sending my son to the world to die and resurrect for the redemption of mankind. When he came, the devil was doing his own. He thought he wanted to kill him. I want to kill this vision. I want to kill this mission. I want to end salvation. It must not spread to the world. Nobody must be saved. He took Jesus to the cross. He killed Jesus on the cross. But at the end of the day, Jesus rose up. But one thing he never remembered, one thing he never knew, was that he was helping the fulfillment of the word of God. He was taking, he was championing and winning. But at the end of the day, he actually helped the word of God to fulfill. The Lord will hear me. Instead of the word of God to fail, the generations, mankind, things, elements, firmaments, sun, moon, and stars, they will gather together to make sure that the word of God will come to pass. It's coming back again. Rapture is near. Remember! Rapture is near. A day of cutting off. A day we meet Jesus in the air. Are you prepared? 
Are you ready? Are you watching? Are you watching? Or you are sleeping? Many believers are sleeping. Many don't believe again. There are many that are carried away. There are many that are carried away by their problems. And the situation of the earth. Many are, many are tired of waiting. And they are losing faith. Beloved, hear me. Don't be tired of waiting. Jesus will surely come. Jesus will surely come. We are at the end of the days. And any moment rapture comes. Rapture. Rapture. It will happen unannounced. Nobody will tell you. It will happen like a thief in the night. It will happen like a thief in the night. Matthew 24 verse 27. Matthew chapter 24 verse 27. He says, For as the lightning cometh of the east, and shineth even to the west, so shall the coming of the Son of Man be.